Hello everyone. Good morning, all of you. Today, in our environmental study class, we will learn about plants. Understood? So, students, when we take care of something, okay, uh, in your chapter, it is given that plants are our friends. Understood? So, why do we need friends? Because they help each other. They take care of each other. Okay, when we need something, they share with us. Okay, so this is a bond with our friends. So, we should always keep that bond with plants also. Why? Because plants also gives us fresh environment, fresh oxygen. Because without oxygen, nobody is possible here. Okay, no life will be exist. Okay, and uh, it gives us fruits, vegetables, so many things. Understood? So, in this class, we will learn about plants, how many types of plants, what are the main usage of plants, what this plants gives us, how should we uh, behave with our plant, understood. So, this will, we will read. Okay. Now, first is, Kiara do not pluck the flower. Okay, in your chapter, Kiara's mother is saying, do not pluck a flower. So, why do you always say that? Now, Kiara is asking that, ma, ma, Mommy, why do you always ask these things? Or tell me these things that uh, uh, should not pluck the plant. Okay. Now, she is saying, who is saying? Her mother. They look beautiful on plants and make our surroundings look beautiful. Okay. Moreover, plants are living beings and they get hurt when we pluck their part, parts. Isn't it? When anybody pluck my finger, I'll get hurt. I'll feel that pain. Understood? So, plants also, they are living beings. They also get pain or hurt when you pluck them. Understood? So, we should always do not pluck the flowers. We should always water them. Okay? We should take care of that plants. Understood? Now, what is the, what is plants? How they become our friends? So, it is given. Plants are our friends because they, now students, what we get from a plants? We get food, we get vegetables, we get medicine, we get fresh air, oxygen. These all things we get from plants. Understood? Now, plants keep our surroundings fresh and beautiful. Understood? When a flower came out from a plant, it, it looks very amazing. Understood? Very charming. Okay. So, that is the usage of plants. Now, parts of plants, there are so many parts of plants. We have a parts of body now. We have a forehead, we have a nose, we have a uh, cheeks, chin, lips. These all are our parts of body. Our hands, wrist, elbows, arms. These all are our parts of the body. So, plants all has also their parts of bodies. Understood? Okay. Now, I'm just naming one by one. Can you see? Can you tell me what is this? These all are soil. Okay. S-O-I-L. Soil. Soil means you know when we say mitti, that is soil. Students, these are roots. Understood? These are roots. When we bow a seed, when we sample a seed into the ground, when it comes out, so it donates their roots into the ground and then it comes out to the ground understood now when it is coming from here can you see this thing this is the stem and that's a stem s t e m okay now stem these are greeny leaves so leaf understood now firstly when a leaf come out when it comes out as a flower then this is a flower okay now, when the flower mature, then it comes to a fruit or a vegetable. Understood? Fruit or a vegetable. That is a product of the plant. Understood? So, stem. What, what does the stem do? It supports, it supports the plant. If stem will be not here, how does the plant come out and it grows in many ways? It will not give any of the branches like it. Okay. These all are the branches. These all are the branches. Understood? Okay. See? They are the branches. Understood? Now, leaf. What does leaf do? It makes food for the plant. Okay, students. Tell me. Who makes food for us? Our mother. Okay. Or I make food for myself. Understood? 
okay when you are well enough to do your own things but when we are smaller when we are child then our mother makes food for us so for plants leaf leaves make food for them okay now roots what does roots do it grows in the soil and fixes the plant to the soil okay when we are sapling a seed into the soil it just gives their roots to the soil so that a plant can grow easily okay now flower it produces fruit as i told you when leaves gives a flower the flowers mature then it gives us a fruit understood now fruit a fruit has seeds inside seed grows into a new plant now whatever the seed will be there inside that fruit okay that will again when you sapple it into the uh, ground it will uh, come as a new plant understood so these all are the exceptions of plants parts of a plants okay now there are so many types of plants okay there are so many types of human being now such are smaller so many are so taller okay there are uh, some pe people they are very fat some are very thin okay some are very beautiful some are very ugly understood so that is a and no one is ugly in this world they are most beautiful because god has made us so god has made a very good creature on this earth so whatever is there it is good for us understood so there are types of plants also how there exists a great diversity among plants now diversity means changes when you feel changes when you are uh, adolescent like uh, when you are 8 years old 9 years old then you become 12 years old then you become 15 years old your pace changes that is diversity of time okay now they can be different types such as trees shrubs herbs climber and creepers so there are such types of plants so have you seen trees mango tree banyan tree neem tree they are very big tall woody hardy type yes so that types of plants now shrubs have you seen shrubs shrubs are like rose have you seen rose plant or lemon plants they are like that have you seen herbs hops means coriander mint mint means you know pudina that is mint very short plants you can eat that also Clim climbers and creepers now climbers need a support of a wall like uh, money plant yes like that and uh, have you uh, seen creepers that is watermelon plants pumpkin plants they does not need any support bottle gourd they just go on ground like a snack understood so these all are the examples we will read it slowly 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 trees shrubs herbs climbers and creepers understood so with that we have completed our introduction of plants what this plants gives us why do we need some plants how should we take care of the plants what are the some parts of the plants and now in the next class we will read types of plants okay slowly slowly so thank you